Good evening, YouTubers. I want to do a what's in my bag video for the newly purchased Nine West tote, nine on the go. Originally $79. It was reduced down to $40. Marshall's price was $39.99. And then they put this bag on clearance for $32. So here she is. She is a nice, big, tall, roomy tote. There's a zip in the front, gold tone zippers, nice wide pocket in the front, really fun lining, and the pocket is almost as wide and as deep as the bag, and this is trimmed in man-made Safiano leather, and it has a slight sheen to it, really nice zippers. Here's the logo plate. And this is like an enamel plate with gold tone studs trimmed in the man-made Safiano leather. Here's a closer look at the hardware and the details. It came with a hang tag. It's kind of like a luggage tag. It's kind of like a card case. And this can definitely accommodate, this is a business card size. And it can definitely accommodate several business cards with no problem. And this can also fit a wallet size picture or an ID as well, with no problem, as you can see. This is a nice add-on piece that, depending on who would uh, make this, could sell separately for as much as I purchased the bag for. So it has a nice drop to the handles, and the handles do lay down, and then to the... For the opening, it is a completely smooth gold tone zipper. I have no problem opening and closing this bag. And for a tote to have a zip top is, is kind of rare. Usually there's it's a just big wide open space or one mag snap right there that would close it. I like that this tote has a nice zipper. And as you can see, it opens nice and wide. And it has a back zip pocket, also with the logo plate in man-made leather. It has a nice deep back wall pocket and two front wall pockets. One is a little bit smaller than the other, also lined in the man-made Safiano leather. It has a fun cotton lining and you can pretty much interpret the pattern the way you want, but it reminds me of two high heels, one stacked on top of the other, which is fun. And as you can see, this bag can hold a lot. And I'm pretty much carrying around what I normally carry around. I can pull it out real quick to give you perspective. My cosmetic case I purchased from the thrift shop. My pouches, oh, my coupons, my pouches I got from the dollar store. As you can see here, my reusable shopper from Old Navy. I do use this a lot more than I anticipated. More coupons and my notepad. As you can see, I could keep going. My wallet. This is my carabiner I purchased from Harper Freight and Craft. I think I'm getting the name right. Anyway, it's meant to hold like a whole bunch of grocery bags at the same time. I actually do use this. It's pretty fun. I got this for a dollar. If I'm getting the name of the store right, then you know what I'm talking about. My store tags, which I'm going to store in a different way car keys and then as you can see this can also probably double as an overnight bag a gym bag a diaper bag this this is great then there's obviously this stuff here I'm not gonna really take that out a little notepad my Excedrin my card case my gum so there you have it I just wanted to give you a look at what's in my bag has a nice wide bottom. I would say that's about five inches. Let's see if I'm right. Yeah, just about five and a half inches in depth. This bag is nice and tall as well. At about 13 inches high. No, what does that say, Caitlin? It's about 14. 14 inches high. And how wide do you think it is? Oh, let's go that way. About 16 inches wide. So 
So if you are lucky enough to see this at your local Marshalls or your local TJ Maxx, it is definitely a nice quality nylon bag and a nice alternative to some of the nylon brands that are out there that are two and three and four times the price at $32.99 on clearance. And it is, hopefully if we get close, we can see that the quality of this nylon is very soft and very thick and very substantial, but still super lightweight. It feels very, very, very identical to the quality of nylon that Dooney and Burke offers. Very soft, and it feels more like a denier fabric than you would think of when you think of a nylon. As uh, the stitching is done beautifully on this brand, and the closer you get at it, the more, the more detail you see, it's very well made. So thanks for watching. What's in my bag? My Nine West tote purchased from Marshalls at on clearance price. Have a good night, YouTubers. Bye.